contest is for the EAW Light Heavyweight Championship and it is for the first time ever a dumpster match and a monster's brawl. Fans bring the weapon match. The only way to win is by placing your opponent inside the dumpster and closing the lid. Please welcome to the ring first. He is the AW Light Heavyweight Champion, T.K. Hayward. Now, guys, it's time for that match that we've been talking about all month. I cannot wait. I'm like a kid in a candy shop right now. And you know what? All my dreams are well. I've got goosebumps as I hear T.K. Hayward music. I'm excited. It's the first time ever. The crossover match, the Monsters Brawl, where fans bring their own weapons. A Monsters Dumpsters Brawl, as I'm going to call it. Cross, 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 cross with that dumpster match. As we heard Nick say, the only way to win this match is to place your opponent inside that dumpster and close the lid. Because as we see TK Hayward coming out, because as we, as we just heard as well, he took the light heavyweight championship from Mr. Monster. And of course, those two had a brutal match last uh, last month. And of course, uh, a plant pot exploded over the head of Mr. Monster. That's right, yeah. I mean, we saw uh, Mr. Monster go to a table. There was a pint of pins brought into the match. Both men falling victim to those. It was an absolutely insane match. And of course, the fans wanted it, and it kind of went up a whole new level. Bring the weapons yourself, they said, and they certainly have. I see sticks out in the out in the crowd. We got we got pints. We got we got all sorts. We got bits of board. We got an iron somewhere. I saw an iron earlier on this evening. It's going to be mental. One of my favourite wrestlers in EAW. I love these kind of men. Absolutely crazy. You just never know what they're going to do. Mr. Monster. This is a man who gives 110% in his art, in the wrestling industry, for the fans. It's Mr. Monster. Of course, with that customised steel chair in hand. Of course, the fans already going absolutely crazy. And of course, the last time Mr. Monster was in a ring here in Ruston, he left more than, more than one pool of blood behind. So we went to see him in uh, hospital, actually, didn't we? We went, we, we, uh, we went to visit him. He was, uh, he was shaken and stirred, but he was definitely out for revenge on TK Hayward. And of course, eyeing up the weapons of what he can use later on to force punishment onto TK Hayward, the light heavyweight champion himself. Predictions for this match, uh, Mastermind. Well, I mean, Mr. Monster, he's a, he's a master of the Monster Brawl. He's a master of the Dumpster match. But saying that previously against TK Hayward, he didn't win. He, 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 didn't, quite, uh, he didn't quite have what it takes. TK Hayward just, he kind of went that extra mile, smashing that plant pot over Mr. Monster's head. And I think he surprised a lot of people in that match. So, I mean, you presume Mr. Monster would have this one easy, but don't write off TK Hayward as he was able to get that victory last time out. Certainly could, and I'm, I'm not writing off anybody, but uh, you know, I'm just, uh, like I said, I'm just a fan right here, right now, enjoying this uh, Monster's Dumpster Brawl match. It's gonna be phenomenal. Strap yourself in, kids, it's gonna be a bumpy ride. Of course, grabbing that light heavyweight championship, you, you got to feel that uh, TK Hayward's got that confidence behind him. Well, he's got that massive win last month, as we say, against Mr. Monster. Batter up, as I think what must, uh, Mr. Monster is trying to say. That's TK Hayward just diving out of the ring. Yeah, that's probably the best idea, to be honest. He's looking for some weapons. No one seems to want to give him any. And Mr. Monsters is taking a seat in, uh, inside the ring. I think he knows no one's going to give him a weapon. Because now he's going to go in there. Uh, well, picking up all the weapons he can. He's going to a bit of a collection. 
And uh, all TK Hayward's got is an empty water bowl. I'm not sure if that was the fans giving him a, uh, a weapon or just the fact that they'd done with their drinks, so they, got rid of, they wanted to get rid of the bottle. Um, Mr. Monster trying to make his way back into the ring. Oh, and taking a chair shot from his own chair. He's maximised Mr. Monster chair. Swing and a miss from TK Hayward. Close line from Mr. Monster. Taking him down with authority. And the fun's about to begin. And I see some fans have made their own customised... Is that, is that a baking tray? <laughs> So Mr. Monster customised baking chains for some of his biggest fans. Yeah, you can get them at all uh, good uh, hardware stores now. I believe Joseph Parker there think he was going to get a, uh, a just shot. Joseph Parker just ducking down and Mr. Monster flying straight into TK Hayward off the back of referee Joseph Parker. And I thought referees have to be impartial but you're not going to argue with uh, a man. Uh, with his stability as uh, Mr. Monster. Oh, what, a, what a view that is. And TK Hayward uh, getting told up by uh, Joseph Parker that hard oh, Hayward. Is that Ken? Is that Ken? Yeah, like, uh, oh, a couple of bits of bamboo stuck together, like uh, basically what a kendo stick is. It's being used now to choke uh, TK Hayward. Of course, no, uh, no submissions, no pinfalls, no count outs, no disqualifications. The only way Mr. Monster is going to win this match is by taking TK Hayward and dumping him into that uh, dumpster. Into that dumpster. Um, I'm intrigued to see whether uh, whether this dumpster was uh, was ready for him or if they just literally grabbed it out of the back here of the Pemberton Leisure Centre. It certainly, looks, it certainly smells like it. And of course, uh, Mr. Monster now getting the toys, and as we see, a bag of rubbish. What have we got in there? Rubbish. He's ripping open the bag of rubbish. Oh, it's lots and lots and lots of empty cans. And that's what Mr. Monster brought this morning after a heavy morning's uh, drinking. Quite his training session. Yeah. And those customised uh, baking trays being used onto the back of Mr. Monster. And of course, folks, don't forget, recycling is important. Oh, landing on oh, those Mr. Cans. Monster just showed. TK Hayward is screaming in pain. As Mr. Monster looks back into that dumpster for uh, an ironing board, really. He's got some ironing board. Got ironing to do. The place to do it. He's recycling, he's ironing, he's basically a domestic god. And he's That's got what a, he's trying to say. He, and he's got a jiffy bag. What's that? Jiffy bag. Uh, is, that, is that a fish? That. You know, I've always wanted to do this. Oh, that's that, oh, oh. Kiss from the fish. Kissing the salmon. Wow. I've always wanted to slap someone with a fish. I was wondering what that smell was. Oh, it's just... Sloppy kiss from the fish straight to TK Hayward, but that's... Uh, that, yeah, I was wondering what that smell was. It must have been that one. I'm hoping it was the fish. <laughs> And Joseph Parker again being again. used as a toy for Mr. Monster. Oh! Catching him with boots in the back of the head. Absolutely phenomenal. And of course, Mr. Monster now really on top of this uh, Monster Dumpster Brawl match. I guess Joseph Parker's just in there for one reason, is that, and that's to call that, uh, call that a win. So I guess well, there's nothing wrong with Mr. Monster just asking, uh, asking the referee to... Uh, to be part of the match, yeah, to be honest. To, to, to provide. We've got a draw. Yeah. We've got a draw. We've got a tennis back out of the scene. Well, as we got into the crowd, uh, I, I see a white pole, some more poles. Then that's some old. Some... Well, there's still the iron board in there. There's all those cans still. We've got some shoe boxes on the other side of the of the ring. We've got some inflatable hammers. And Mr. Monster is doing, having a collection for charity. And uh, Joseph Parker getting hit by an inflatable bat there. And look at all the fans, really. Well, I'm not sure you can see from here, Kai, but TK Hayward's bat. It's a mess already after he took that landing on those cans. Oh, my word. Certainly is. He's going to need to have a massage afterwards. Some more light holes coming in. Got the inflatable zimmer. 
Andy Rain's brought his uh, dinner frame clearly. And another chair as well. So I think we have all the toys. Taking too long to get those toys uh, for Mr. Monster with TK Hayward. Now really pounding and getting back on top of uh, Mr. Monster in this uh, light heavyweight match. And that ring's really just filled up with, uh, with weapons and goodies. Ooh, and uh, that chop went right through me. Oh, third time. That's going to leave a mark. For TKA, well, uh, I guess he owes him. He's got that draw. Oh, straight through that draw. The crowd now get, trying to get behind Mr. Monster, trying to get the energy. Like I keep on about uh, this, the energy from the crowd is so important when you're in the ring and you're kind of uh, behind into the match. TK Hayward is really smashing. If he's not careful, he's going to really open up that wound he caused last month with that flower pot. I think that's the idea of what he's going for. Really pounding on to the back of uh, Mr. Monster. TK Hayward really kind of, well, I guess he's surprising a lot of people with, uh, with how he's faring here because Mr. Monster, he's no, uh, he's no pushover. The guy loves pain. That's what people forget about Mr. Monster. He loves pain. He's loving this right now. Even though he's, uh, he's, he's not winning this match, he's not on top of this match. He, you know deep down he's absolutely enjoying it. And of course, uh, LCT uh, came. How do you hurt someone that's, uh, that, that likes pain? You know, I mean, the more you beat down on Mr. Monster, the, kind of, the, the, the more it fires him up. I mean, he's, he's really a unique competitor in that sense. We just saw TK Hayward trying to get Mr. Monster into that dumpster. However, he did fight back as they're using, what is it, a walking stick. Wow. I mean, we've got absolutely everything in this, uh, this match right at the moment. And here's a good old iron board. They're going to take it. Setting up in the corner. They're taking extreme ironing to a whole new level right here. Uh, so maybe, maybe there's a market there for a spin-off. The EAI, Extreme American Ironing. I'm not entirely sure what, uh, what, that, what that is there. For this it's like a guttering pole, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, definitely. TK Hayward. An unorthodox, uh, unorthodox star. But then again, that's what Mr. Monster is all about. And of course, that, that level of volume into the ear of TK Hayward, that's going to pop an eardrum or two. Oh, Mr. Monster is missing that, uh, that Bronco Buster. And what's TK Hayward got in mind here? Trying to whip Mr. Monster into that island board. Not going to happen. Oh, oh, oh. spear straight, straight through that island board. TK Hayward just driving Mr. Monster straight through that island board. If Mr. Monster had any wrinkles, he certainly doesn't now. Everything's through now. Is he going to try and force Mr. Monster into that, uh, into that dumpster? But there's a crook. Remember, he's got to get him into that dumpster and he's got to close that lead as uh, Mr. Monster holding on to that rope and uh, you know I have got high hopes as uh, TK Hayward really pounding and he's in he's, he's in that all TK Hayward has to do is close that lid to retain come on Monster you can, get, you can do this it. what's referee Joseph Parker doing helping and Mr. Monster is fighting back thank goodness and uh, the boat yeah, they're, they're, they're both down both, both men are in the dumpster Joseph, Joseph, Joseph Parker Joseph Parker oh both men are popping out both got signed of some sort sign go sign I'll go oh my monster right. sign we'll go with that monster, 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 monster. as uh, Mr Monster closing trying to close the list getting another he's weapon he's got to climb out as well and close that list a TK Hayward he's fighting on well, when you go to a championship, you want to hold on to that as much as possible. And when you're going up against Mr. Monster in this kind of match, you've got to have some uh, balls and audacity to, uh, to compete. And TK Hayward just crawling out. But TK Hayward's out, Mr. Monster's half in. He's trying to uh, get all the strength, TK Hayward, to try and get Mr. Monster into that dumpster. And Mr. Monster just hanging on. He's teetering on the edge of that dumpster. Oh, 
Oh, that Mr. Monster's in. He is in. Oh, TK, hey, what he needs to do is close that lid. Where's he going? Oh, well, I think he's got some ideas. And Mr. Monster's up. Got TK in hand. TK Haywood just holding on. Fighting his way out, fighting for his life to get out of that dumpster. Of course, both men now out of that dumpster, back into the ring. And of course, the game is about to begin once again. The chance of Let's Go Monster. And another suplex. Onto those cans, my goodness. As you can see, TK Hayward now really, he's, he, he's in a lot, a lot of pain right now. Of course, uh, Mr. Monster helping out. Well, his back was already marked from that first, uh, from that first tumble into those cans. And of course, uh, Mr. Monster now looking for more weapons, and we have found a bit of board there, uh, which I believe, uh, you know, if you're going to give a man a weapon like uh, Mr. Monster, he's going to do something with it. Of course, using the playable hammer. Not sure Mr. Monster's uh, impressed with the... I don't think uh, he's, in, he's a fan of them, is he? The ability or the, 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 the devastating effects of uh, an inflatable hammer. Because, uh, uh, wow, a two point four. I think that was a canvas there. That's not going to paint a pretty portrait of uh, TK Hayward. But he's doing a lot of wonders for uh, Mr. Monster there. So I'm trying to uh, look around the crowd and see what else we have in the way of... Uh, in the way of weapons. And that's, that's a, a mighty pole. Smart move there by TK Hayward. Just shutting the lid of that dumpster. Obviously he hasn't got much confidence in this match at the moment. Whereas uh, Mr. Monster really collecting all his toys again. Oh my word, Mr. Monster taking TK Hayward and just launching him into the side of that, uh, that dumpster. The fans call it for one more time. Here we go and run up. And oh my word. Inside out goes TK Hayward. And of course, not only do you have the initial impact of your head and your, your, your back hitting that dumpster, but there's also that split second you've got falling to the ground. I mean, there's pads out there, but I mean, they don't take an awful lot out of that, uh, that wooden floor. So only if you go head first into them, you're, you're going to really probably end up in hospital. And of course, most of these men will. And of course, there. Now, Mr. Monster has a bag, what looks like a bag of swag. I'm sure he's been to the bank. What's he got in mind? Oh, from what I'm thinking. Is that? Oh, the is that Lego? The kid. I think onto bits of Lego. No, I mean, oh, it's more Lego as well. Now we both know. Everybody knows it's a fact. That there is nothing worse than stepping on a piece of Lego. I mean, that hurts. That it's really hurts. Really cool. he's, 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 he's lining up for a. Uh, What's he going for now? Powerball onto Lego. I would not like to be TK Hayward at, uh, at this moment in time. Wait a, a second. Power bomb. It looks like a power, power drive. He's going to go for a power Wait a second. Driver. He can't quite get him up. But Mr. Monster's going over. Oh! Back first onto that Lego. Right now, everything is definitely not awesome. It really is. In the world of Mr. Monster. Let me go. Oh, oh, yeah. I'm sure the head won't be in a perfect position. Mr. Monster taking one ahead of a tumble. Onto that Lego. He, he, he's certainly looking into some pain. Uh, TK Hayward, I believe, a bit more confident. He's opened up that dumpster and he's uh, now going under the ring to find out if he can find anything to dish out more punishment onto Mr. Monster. You oh, see the back of Mr. Monster. Monster. Oh, it's TK Hayward right now. It's a wooden board. It is a wooden board. It's placed over the dumpster. He's setting that up over the dumpster. What's he got in mind? What's he setting up now? No, I don't. No, I don't do it. I mean, when, when two people have a feud, that, that's one thing. When people, two people want to fight, but when they want to put a dumpster and do something like this, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's, an, it's a different ball game, really, isn't it? Well, this looks, this looks like it could get, uh, could get even more dangerous. You see the Lego just falling out the back of uh, Mr. Monster. Look at this. 
Balboa just snapping in two over the head of Mr. Monster. Mr. Monster holding his head. Pro breaker. Wow. What an absolutely phenomenal Both pro breaker. Both down right now. It's now anyone's game is who can get, off, uh, get to their feet and, uh, and drive the other into the dumpster. Certainly is, and of course he's got that board in the way. Mr. Monster hasn't really seen that board so far, but he's he's he's, he's now putting TK uh, Hayward onto that board. What's he going to do? So this is a man with uh, many screws yeah, loose. I, I wasn't sure if TK Hayward was looking to uh, kind of cover up the entrance of that uh, of that dumpster to, to kind of like get in his way so he couldn't be forced into it, or if he's looking to force Mr. Monster to do it. But it seems to have backfired either way as he's laying out, he's laying alongside it. Oh, Mr. Monster just gone right through and he's in that dumpster. He's, he's in. Uh, of course, the crowd just gone a bit of a stunned silence as Mr. Monster, I can see some sort of movement in there. And uh, the dumpster has uh, toppled over. TK Hayward, not sure what's going on. Uh, Referee Joseph Parker is uh, go, now going to the aid of uh, Mr. Monster. Uh, Mr. Monster is currently in that dumpster right now. And there's a hand, there's a weapon. I see a hand. One last gasp of uh, energy. Mr. Monster gets a weapon. You can always trust this guy. And Mr. Monster, he's, he's teetering, he's inches away from losing this match right now. Okay, if only he could just fight out, get that one last bit of energy. And he's fighting back, he's fighting back against TK Hayward. This is the heart of Mr. Monster on show right now. He wants that type. Oh, and a super kick. Straight face, he's in the lift shot. The lift. TK Hayward's done it. Oh my goodness. What an absolute brutal match. Oh my word. TK Hayward. I thought Mr. Monster was going to make his way out of that dumpster. But TK Hayward from the ring apron just kicking Mr. Monster straight in the face. There's no way, there's no nicer way of putting it. He just kicked him square in the jaw. I wouldn't be surprised if Mr. Monster's unconscious in that dumpster right now. We can see the hand coming from up of the, uh, the dumpster and the lid being closed on him. Good night, Mr. Monster. As TK Hayward is up onto the turnbuckle, celebrating his... You know, it's his win, he's still got the light heavyweight championship. And what a devastation is the ring at the moment. But at what cost has he still got that belt? We've seen ironing boards break, we've seen Lego, we've seen, we've seen cans, we've seen drawers. We've seen fish. Don't we've forget about the fish. fish. There's so much in that match, I can barely keep up. Nothing like Kid in the Haddock, but when he's walked away after Kid in the Haddock with the gold, I'd rather be TK Hayward. Wait a second, I hear a voice. Don't you go anywhere. It's the monster there. Got a few words to say, I think he's a bit hurt. Well, yeah, he took that massive kick when he went diving through that board and was over the. Uh, over the dumpster. Yeah. I'm a whole movie character. Yeah. Yeah. Did you kill me film after film? The next film, I just come right back. Yeah. 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 Speaking of the next film, the October show. Mr. Monster could barely held his own weight. I heard it mentioned earlier on. Someone said TLC. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm the jockey going to get in first for this one. Who wants to see me versus TK Hayward with a bell up there? TLC. Wow. Mr. Monster calling for the TLC. Yeah. He wants first did. He wants destruction. This morning, this wide space. We dance, 